Hello, uh, my name is uh, A.K. Tareen. I'm the South Australian Government Senior Trade Commissioner to India. I'm here today at FAPSI to uh, address the members of FAPSI uh, in Hyderabad. This is my second address in the last two years as we try to build very close relationships between South Australia and Andhra Pradesh. And I think FAPSI is a very important uh, industry organization through which we can reach out to thousands of their members across Andhra Pradesh. I'm here basically today to um, inform the members of FAPSI about business opportunities uh, that exist for the members to do with South Australia. This spans a number of areas like education, uh, um, tourism, uh, investments in South Australia, mining, defence, automotive, uh, renewable energy and so on and so forth. Uh, what I would like to highlight to the viewers is that not many people know much about South Australia. When they say Australia, they usually think about Sydney, Melbourne and Gold Coast. But uh, South Australia is perhaps one of the best kept secrets for Indians, be it for education or migration or for tourism or just for you know uh, doing business. Uh, just to give you a brief about South Australia, we are the education city of Australia. We have three world-class universities. University of Adelaide, which is one of the oldest um, and one of the highly ranked uh, universities in Australia, uh, University of South Australia with, uh, and Flinders University in South Australia. Um, in addition to these three world-class universities, we also have uh, uh, campuses of two international universities in Adelaide, which is University College of London and Carnegie Mellon University. It's just not in tertiary education, but we also have a very strong vocational education and skills training. I think uh, as India embarks upon to train half a billion youth in vocational skills and training, I think South Australia is looking to play a very important role uh, in partnering with India in imparting those kind of skills that the Indian uh, youth uh, are looking for. Next, after education would be, I think, uh, advanced manufacturing. There's a huge synergy between Andhra Pradesh and South Australia, not just in education, but advanced manufacturing as well. Uh, this includes automotive components, um, defense and uh, high technology uh, manufacturing processes. Uh, we uh, have General Motors Holden and a very strong support base uh, catering to General GM Holden in South Australia. And in addition to that, we are the defence capital of Australia. Some of the biggest companies, uh, international companies that operate in Australia have their presence in South Australia. Um, after defence, the another area of synergy for us would be renewable energy. We are the Adelaide is the first green city of Australia. Um, we have. When I say we, South Australia has nearly half of Australia's uh, wind power, nearly one third of solar power and a significant amount of uh, geothermal energy. A number of Indian companies like such as Suzlon have invested in South Australia in, in this sector.